Hi there, Bernadette McGree here with Beginner's Yoga. Today we're going to do um, Tadasana, mountain pose, standing, and take our arms up to the sky. We're also going to add a lateral bend into that. So please bring your feet so that they're hip width and parallel. Remember that the base of your second toe lines up with your middle of ankle, and each of, on each foot, those two lines are parallel like train tracks. Press your feet into the floor, lift up through the crown of your head. Tuck your chin in a little, and even just sort of wriggle your shoulders onto your back. Turn your palms to face the front. From there, take a breath in, stretch your arms out to the side and up to the sky. So your arms are up nice and high. This is called Urdhva Hastasana. What I want you to be aware of when you take your arms up is the tendency to arch your back. And I'll talk more about this in another video, but for, for the moment, with your arms up, I want you to see if you can tone the pelvic floor, tone your tummy, and then invite the bottom ribs into the back part of your body. So instead of the ribs popping forward, have a sense of them going back a little bit. Just like if you were to round your back, but not that much. In fact, it's very hard to round. It's not that easy to round your back while your arms are overhead. So see if you can just create that tone in the front of your body. Make sure your gaze is straight ahead. You can take your gaze up as well. If you do that, keep the back of your neck long. So you don't want to sort of creep the back of your neck by dropping it. You want to keep length in the back of your neck if you take your neck up. Keep pressing your feet into the floor. Breathe in. And then breathe out and let your arms come back down. So let's do that a few times with the breath. Make the legs strong. Keep pressing the feet into the floor. Inhale, take your arms up to the side, up to the sky, look up. Exhale and let the arms follow the breath on the way down. Breathing in, stretch the arms out to the side, up to the sky. Breathing out and let your arms come down. Remember to keep tone in the front body the whole way through. Inhale, stretch your arms out to the side, up to the sky. Exhale and bring your arms down. Another thing that's really important to realize is when you take your arms out to the side and up to the sky, try not to lift your shoulders towards your ears. You want to keep your shoulders exactly where they are you're literally just moving the arm like you're doing a snow angel, except that you're standing. Okay, inhale, straighten your arms, take your arms out to the side, up to the sky, and then exhale. And when you exhale and turn your arm, um, bring your arms down, just turn your palms down. Breathe in, stretch your arms out to the side, up to the sky, maybe looking up. Exhale and bring them down. And hopefully you can feel each time that you take your arms up, there is this natural arching of the back. And every time you feel that, just literally almost imagine that you're zipping up through the front. So it's like zip. And you're drawing the sides of your ribs in, the sides of your waist in, the sides of your hip sides in, and keeping it all contained. I'll talk more about those muscles on another occasion. I just wanted to give you that experience of stretching your arms up and just literally moving with the breath. Enjoy your practice, I'm sure you're going well.